The sweet sounds heard on the streets of Boston today, and this is a musical miracle of sorts. The man playing the instrument there is coming back from some career-threatening injuries. And tonight, he is ready to step back into the spotlight. For 35 years, Boris Popovich has played the flute, performing all over the world. Today, he's trying out his chops in downtown Crossing. Boris is also a flute maker and repairer. But three months ago, he was almost killed in a freak accident. Trees are kind of going over the road, and one of them decided to fall on the cars. And I was down in the passenger seat, you know, bleeding, and uh, I couldn't move my neck. He was trapped. I felt my arm numb, and I was thinking, my God, this is a life changer, not in a good way. He fractured four vertebrae and could no longer play. The whole nerve going through the right arm was damaged. Through hard work and long therapy, he was able to pick up the flute just two weeks ago, though the pain and the numbness continued. I was very happy. <laughs> and this weekend, he'll make a debut of sorts, giving two lunchtime outdoor performances in downtown Boston. I'm excited. I like it. I like performing. I've been performing since I was like 18. Wow. Boris hasn't been able to work for the last three months, so he really needs to make a financial comeback at the same time. If you'd like to find out where he's performing on Friday and Saturday, go to our website, cbsboston.com. We will connect you, and you can maybe even help him out a little bit. The sound is incredible. And when you see the pictures of that car, yeah. to know what he's been through since then, it really is tremendous. What a great story. Ken Tucci, by the way, putting that together, our producer. Fantastic. Really nice. And it sounds like he 